Yes, I'm a little taller, just a little taller. Hello, uh, the title I've been given was the Fire for Excellent Example, and there's no better example than Jesus who did everything in excellence. In John chapter 13, starting in verse one, it says, it was just before the Passover festival, Jesus knew that the hour had come for him to leave this world and go to the Father. Having loved his own who were in the world, he loved them to the end. The evening meal was in progress, and the devil had already prompted Judas to betray betray Jesus. And here, as you keep reading, Jesus is about to wash his disciples' feet. And in verse 12, it says, when he had finished washing their feet, he put on his clothes and returned to his place. Do you understand what I have done for you? He asked them. You call me teacher and Lord, and rightly so, for that is what I am. Now that I, your Lord and teacher, have washed your feet, you also should wash one another's feet. I have set you an example that you should do as I have done for you. This scripture is so amazing. And I love that instead of using this time to teach the disciples and tell them what to do, Jesus shows them with his own example of what he should do. And I love that being an example, by Jesus' example, comes down to your willingness to die to yourself over and over again. Wow. Dying to your pride to show humility to others. Dying to your selfishness to show servitude. Dying to our insecurity, women, so that we can be bold women for God. Wow. Are you willing to not only wash disciples' feet, but also the lost. Yeah. Jesus washed Judas's feet. We get below everyone in this world to serve and be the example. And there's a lot of pressure with being an example. And moving to Los Angeles and training, I've been put in many scenarios where I've been told you have to be the example. You are the only one to be the example. And I would have questions running through my head like, why does it have to be me though? Where's everyone else? Where's everyone else that wants to be the example? Why am, I, why am I the one being asked to give more, to serve more, to fill in the gap? But the answer is simple, ladies. When we declare that Jesus is Lord, we declare to walk as he walked, to talk as he talked, and to die as he died. We declare to be the example for the whole world to see because everyone is watching you. Do you understand the responsibility we have, ladies, to uphold for the sake of other women's salvation? Women are watching how you talk, how you walk, how you uphold yourself, your composure. Stand up tall, ladies. We are women of God to be the example for the world. And if we do not follow Jesus' example, it will not only hurt us, but everyone else who is watching us. There is a fire in being a servant. There is a fire in having the same character as Jesus. There is a fire in following Jesus' example. The question is, are you doing it? Genuinely ask yourself, are you dying to yourself every day to be the example for disciples and for the women in the world? My challenge for you is to study out Jesus' character and pick one thing to go after. It is only when we have the same character as Jesus that we will be the best examples for the disciples and the world. I want to leave you with a quote, and it says, A good example has twice the value of good advice. To God be all the glory.